Hey, Chip. I'm on my way to Lamar right now. I'll show you for yourself. Awesome. First issued. When the alert is first issued, give it to them free. I'll be at Lamar in two minutes, and you can hear it for yourself. When the Amber Alert yeah, for a Child it. is first, hang on. Amber Alert for a Child is first issued. They give it to them free of charge. We're four months past that. You have to pay for it. I'm pulling in Lamar right now, and you all can see for yourself. Anybody wants to ask questions, they need to need to ask more questions. Hey, Chase, can you ask for the manager? Yeah, I'm doing it right now. Look, right here. And Chase, if they're lying, you. Chase, you better sort them out if they're lying because they've just told you. Ask for the manager, Chase. Well, hold on. You see this? Look. Yeah, I believe you. Yeah, I see you this see that? Lamar thing. Chase, you it's tell the them they just put it in front. This is the last time I'm going to waste time with this crap. It's, it's them, Chase. Time. We've got it recorded. It was them that told us you were fraudulent. Yeah. Not to give you any money. Hang on, Chase. I got you. Hold up. Can you hear this? Oh, yes, sir. Um, I'm, uh, I'm being accused of uh, uh, help raise some money to put a billboard up. Um, I don't know if people telling them it's crazy. Okay. You know, this is ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. I mean, this is crazy. I'm in here, right here. This is ridiculous. If they're lying, they shouldn't be doing that as a company. You can't do anything. I'll tell you what, this is the last time anybody wants to do anything for this little girl, do it yourself, because I'm done. I'm finished. Chase, we've got proof they told us to call the FBI and don't pass you any money. That's what they told us. Okay, good. Them. Let them. Yeah, that, because uh, I've got the, the receipts manager, for everything I've done. Yeah, Chase, the manager, they even called back and said specifically if there's an active hey, Amber bro, Alert, got, that well, you should be charged. I'm just going to tell here because you all have pretty well destroyed any reputation that I have. I mean, telling them that it's free. I didn't call in to nobody. These we called Lamar. Guys, we spoke is a to the office that told manager. Me to How y'all doing? Hey, buddy. Not we're doing okay. Calls. We called and spoke to the office manager. They said if there's an active Amber Alert up, that you guys do this for free. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Come Sorry, close to Lady Justice so he can hear you. Okay, Chip, hold on. This is the salesperson that sold me the bill for the board, so hold on. Hey, guys. Um, I don't know where the information comes from, but hold everything on. is above them. Brad has paid the money for the billboard. We've even entered into another agreement where we. Why did another... Brad have to pay for the billboard? Because Summer has an active Amber Alert. You guys told us on the phone you do those for free. So well, why did Chase have to we, pay? We did do an Amber Alert, from my understanding. They already we, did it. We already did one. It's and still up. It's still up. It's supposed to the, the your manager told us See. that your people. As long as an Amber Alert, Alert is up, you're yeah, supposed to do it for free. The I think you need to take refund. it down is when the Amber Alert stops. That's what they just told us. And they called him. They called Chase, who you're calling, Brad. They called Chase that it's fraudulent. Okay. And it's police on him. Okay, I can't hang listen on. to everybody at one time. Man. Guys, you can't li he, he cannot listen to everybody at one time. Lady Justice, but please one, tell him. One person at a time. Okay, give me one. I'm going to tell you exactly who the lady was, okay? Because I asked okay. for her name. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm sorry. 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 See, that was your lady that runs the office. We need to report that as a scam? What's your name? Thank you, Angela. Okay, Angela. Okay, that's that's the same kind of manager that you're speaking with that's told them that it was a scam. Angela Cat Chase. 
Angela, who? That's Cat. not at this location, though. That's not at this location, guys. Angela Cat is not at this location. We called the Lamar Billboard Advertising Company and spoke to the lady who was in charge. Which location? There were several Knoxville. Other okay, we're in the Tri Cities Market area. Um, and that's a totally different location than us. Guys, from my understanding, when when the when the Amber Alert first went out back in June, Lamar, I'm coming in as a new person here, okay? Lamar okay. did run an ad for free for uh, several, I don't know if it was for 30 days or 60 days or however long. But in that particular, these type of signs that they're on, they can't continually run for free. Because there's just there's no people out there to pay for the spot that's going to be in their time. So after it runs for their length of time, from my understanding, it just comes off. No, this and is the head grab, company. After a link of time, let, it just comes let off. Him finish. Let him finish. And then from my understanding, Brad has approached me one day. I got this on a sales call that he was looking for a space to put the, the alert back up there. And that's the only part that I have come in on is I really discounted the board. He's taking the donations. Um, I waited for Saturday for me and him to get together. I only work on the clock. Exactly. Hey, sir. Yeah. This man's went above and beyond. I've sir. only been. Hey, excuse me, sir. Yeah, but we've talked to your managers. You did not talk you, to, you did not talk to the managers here. You spoke to a manager at another location. Right. She Is has Lamar all one company? I'm not going to speak over everybody. Listen. Is Lamar what one company? Yeah. I'm not going to speak over everybody. Can I speak to that guy? Yeah. Hey, buddy. Is Lamar one company? We have. We are one company, but. We are across the whole United States, and there are right. 350 billboards that we have. And there's, Great. like, for instance, there's Lamar Knoxville. There's Lamar. We're called Lamar Tri Cities. They're everywhere. These different satellite offices. So he happens to be in our Tri Cities market is what all this come out of. And I don't think Brad has done anything wrong. I don't think Lamar's done anything wrong. Because Brad has been really keeping in touch with me. And I've been just yeah, trying to These folks are in high demand that, that other outside advertisers. And I understand it's a missing young lady. I really do. And I have compassion for my three kids as well. But at the same time. You guys time, should definitely yeah. give him his money back, okay? Like, definitely give him his money back. She has an active Amber Alert. Yeah. They said, God, she had listen, listen, their policy is when the Amber Alert goes out, they will uh -huh. give them the spot for so long. Guys, uh -huh. it's, it's, they can't put it up forever. You all need, well, what happens? It look, I don't want no more donations because I'll do this out of my pocket if it pisses every single one of you off. I'll have every billboard bought in this city by myself. Well, don't put words in our mouth. It doesn't piss us off. We appreciate that you're trying to no, help no, someone. No, what pisses us off I, I, is the I fact that the Lamar help. company said if no, she has no, no, a no, no. Amber Alert. I'm just going to talk over it. I see how much you and everybody else appreciates anything on here that anybody does for a child. Now, look here. If, if they, put, they, they did their part, I'm doing mine. I don't need none of your help, okay? Because every one of you are out for yourself. None of you are out for this child. That's Nobody. a fucking shit. Listen no. here, you, right? We've been doing that for you. We trusted you. <laughs> we found the company to see if we could do it direct because you said you were going to do and that, And cut right? the middleman out. Have I exactly. Now we've in. been told by two people to phone the FBI, and they're phoning the FBI. Look at different me, people because they said that the Amber Alert more. doesn't need payment. Okay, well, th so they don't did have a go at us when all we're trying to do is help someone, and every single person keeps telling us this person's bad, this person's good, this person's bad. Then we get these people from Lamar telling us the same thing. What do you expect us to do? Uh, Pick the phone up and call somebody before you put it out all over everywhere that I'm did. standing We did, we did, and he phoned us back. We said, make sure first, and he phoned Lady Justice back. And so he did. Do, do, you, do you see where I'm coming from? Do you see where I'm coming from? No, I don't. I'm getting back. 
You you don't you don't see no, where I'm I coming from. That people are saying. Then people telling me a load of crap. Then we phone an official company who's telling us, and then the guy phones us back and says, "Quickly get onto the FBI. We're looking for it." He asked okay. for details. He asked where it was located. He said, "I even said Kingsport." I was like, "That billboard is yep. in Kingsport, yep. Tennessee." Okay, it is. It is. It's on Fort Henry Drive in Kingsport. Right. Buddy, you need to talk to the lady over there in the Knoxville area that runs this show then because I think that she's if I'm not putting mistaken, out bad info. I'm telling you, I'm thinking right now that when Brad walked in the door when y'all were all on him and all this here, I, if I'm not mistaken, the Knoxville office was on the phone with our office and trying to get the information straightened out. And if so I'm not mistaken, you, you have to let him talk, guys. Man, Hang this is frustrating. You. For each and every one of you guys, it really is. But I am, I am very much. There's nobody out there. I want to go to the ground, but at the same time, the Knoxville office, I, I can just call our office to make sure that what we're talking about is correct. That's a good idea. Called, whoever called the Knoxville office, supposedly, if I'm not mistaken, is supposed to reach back out to you guys and get the information corrected. But y'all kind of they called me twice. Okay, but listen, this, 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 as soon as they were calling me up here, they were on the phone talking to each other, and I left out of that room while they were talking. Some talk yeah. Out. So if you will give us a little while, I'll let yeah. Dad reach out to you and make sure who, who, who initiated the phone call to the Knoxville office. Lady Justice. Who's that? I, I called Lamar because I wanted to ask them how to send the money directly to them to help Chase. And then they told me, they were asking me where it was at, asking me information about just where it was located and what was on the billboard. And I said, a missing five-year-old little girl from Tennessee. And I said, it's in Kingsport, Tennessee. And uh, she has an active Amber Alert right now. And they said, well, if she has an active Amber Alert then the billboard should be free. Don't give any money for it. That's exactly what she told me. Okay, okay. I can see where that is probably correct, okay? But the Amber Alert that was initially, when we did it for free, was yeah. when it initially happened back in June. Right, right. Guys, Chip, I'm sorry, but you got to understand where I'm coming Chase, from. Chase, I'm sorry for... Damn artist, and I'm, you know, that's just the wrong. miscommunication with Lamar. Yeah, yeah, not being funny, Chase, but if Lamar, if Lamar they've told already put the Amber Alert out. I mean, Chase, and now I just wish that they wouldn't put a fucking expiration date on it. She's not been found yet. They're a business. They have to make money. They're I a business. That. 